Hello everybody, my name is Zupi and today's story I'll bring you guys a cinematic effect. Uh, so let's start it. Uh, first of all, uh, you need to duplicate a layer, then you go to filter, length correction, and choose custom on the type custom and change the vignette as you want and the midpoint as you wish. Uh, next, you need to create a new layer as now we need to set uh, our foreground um, to a brown brown light color this is the code, uh, you just need to copy it, I will put it on the description press ok this is gonna be white, of course not black now uh, we need to go to filter where is render and clouds then you go to render fibers on fibers is gonna make a variate uh, to one um, and you need to get something like this uh, if you don't have something like this you're gonna randomize it randomize it to have something a lot more brighter like this that doesn't matter so done and then uh, you need to put a blending option to multiply and multiply and that's it I think you guys can see it but I will make it invisible and visible to you guys to see the difference between these it's making a real difference quite a bit like the 70s, 16s movies or whatever like the tapes so now we need to go to layer no image no, it's layer, a uh, new adjustment layer and gradient map. Okay. On the gradient map um, you need to set this to special effects. Okay. And click on the shiny sphere and set reverse. Now you need to set the gradient map to overlay and 